What's up guys and welcome back to Ancestors. Uh, this is episode two of our journey and uh, looks like we are moving into day five of our survival. And uh, I'm not gonna lie, I did a little bit of research. I understand the game a little bit better. First of all, big shout out to you guys for uh, all the support in that first episode. But it uh, looks like we're waking up and we are in desperate need of some water so we are gonna go drink here and uh, we had the right idea in the last episode but you actually need to drink way more than I thought you did like this game is is obviously not super super fast obviously it's it's a little bit more tame it's a little bit slowed down a little bit more realistic so as you guys are watching this right here we're currently cold because it's raining but um, every time that that center the center like green circle pulses yellow that actually means that the water is helping us become healthier. So we need to go until that pulse is green. And then that's when we know that we're done drinking. So there we go. We're done drinking. We're going to get out of the water. And then what we're going to do is we are going to come over. We are going to grab some berries. And we're going to eat until it pulses green. And that way we're going to start eventually making our entire way up there. So that our entire circle is green. Whoa, what? What just happened? Are we not supposed to eat those berries? We have some sort of a Some sort of a berry poisoning right now. Hold on a second. Give me a baby. Give me a baby I, I want a baby right now. Hop on my back. There we go. All right. We got to go find ourselves a uh, We're gonna go find some mushrooms to be able to fix this. Oh, this is not good Okay, so we need to uh, we need to use our senses. We're gonna use our sense of smell here and let's see if we can smell out any mushrooms. Let's see if we can find anything. We can smell our, our tribe back there. But we're trying to, we're trying to sniff out some mushrooms. There's some stuff over here. Some stuff potentially down on the forest floor. Let's check this, see what this is. Trying to identify it, I'm not sure. Let's, should we go down and look for it? I'm gonna drop down. I don't think that tree's gonna help us. We need mushrooms, dude. Looks like we found we found another another primate down there, but we really we need to find mushrooms. That's the most important thing. All right, I'm just gonna go ahead and drop down. So basically, we have a uh, a, a debuff right now, and if we find and eat some mushrooms, that's gonna help us out, and it's gonna make it so that we don't have this this poisoning anymore. Or the poisoning is slowly going to go away by itself, but obviously it'd be better if, if we could get rid of it right away. So let's see what we've got going on here. Looks like we have another primate. We have what could be a group of primates over here. Are these guys going to be friendly? I'm pretty sure if we drink, it makes it go away faster too. So let me let me try that. Goodness gracious. I guess you, you learn something new every day. I had no clue that you could eat too many berries. But that is a thing. Oh yeah, drinking makes it, makes it go away. Whew! We're gonna be okay. So it, it just, it, it took down, it took down some of our, our endurance, some of our health a little bit, but we're gonna get it back as we, uh, as we continue to drink here. Okay, anyway, so, welcome back guys. We are gonna be exploring a little bit. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna, I'm gonna get back up near our tribe. We wanna uncover the secrets that this forest has to offer. I wanna start branching out a little bit. I wanna start kind of exploring. And um, we're, we're going to see what we can do, dude. This is going to be fun. So I'm going to get up towards the top, and we're just going to start with a couple of, of different types of plants and stuff. So let's go ahead and use our, uh, let's use our intelligence again. And let's see what we got going on. So we've got something there we could take a look at, something there. Every single one of these little boxes is something that we could, we could inspect and, and kind of discover new. So I'm going to go ahead and focus on this, identify it, memorize it. We're gonna remember it now, and now we're gonna be able to, to back out of this. And it's gonna stay on there, and we're gonna go check it out. So let's let's go get it. Oh my god. Okay, so th things, things are not going well. It just fell out of the tree. I don't know what kind of a chimp we are, primate. I don't, I don't know what the, the correct term is, but we're gonna have to come find this plant right here. This plant helps with broken bones. Grab this plant, we're gonna inspect it. And then if we eat this, it should help out with our broken bone. We're not gonna keep deteriorating. It should it should help out with our health. So cats, we're gonna go ahead and eat. And you guys can see, it should help out with our broken bones. It's also giving us a bit of a buff 
to being cold. So if we ate that and then stayed out in the rain, we'd be fine. All right, so we've got that. Now what we're gonna do is we are gonna come back this way. We're gonna jump onto the tree and we're gonna try to get back up to that objective that we had picked out earlier. I think we already forgot it. I mean, we are, we are a very primitive primate here, so our memory's not perfect. All right, I'm gonna see. This is a little dangerous. I'm gonna jump across. Oh, baby. Oh my gosh. All right, what do we have up here? There's a skull icon. Dead hominid. Is that our friend? Dude, I think that's our friend. I think that's our friend that died to the bird in the very first, like, opening, the opening scene. No way. Do you guys remember that? That means that bird could be, could be close though. No, no, grab this. Come on, baby. That bird could be close, but we gotta go see him. Do we think we're safe? Let's go see this. No, that's so sad. No! Oh my God. We just got, we got attacked by the eagle. We got to, oh shoot, now we're bleeding. Are you serious right now? Dude, <laughs> this is like the worst, the worst thing that could have happened. I was just trying to inspect my friend. I'm pretty sure we could get some XP for that. And the eagle attacked us. Okay, now what we're gonna need is one of these. I guess I'm just gonna give you guys the tour of everything you can get in this game. So now we're bleeding. Obviously we wanna fix that. What we wanna do is grab this if we can, grab it. All right, we can inspect this thing. And this is gonna be some sort of a paste we can put on our body to be able to, um, to stop bleeding. So I'm gonna go ahead and back down here. We're gonna apply this bad boy. And now that's gonna stop the bleeding so we can get back to being healthy. Look at that, just, just like we intended. Okay, where? Dude, we gotta get back up that nest. I'm not giving up. We're back. I'm gonna grab our eggs. I'm gonna inspect the eggs. We're gonna be careful. Hopefully it doesn't come back. New food discovered, all right. And then let's, um. I can hear it. Oh my God. I can hear the, the bird. Dude, I'm, I'm, trying to, I'm trying to inspect our friend. I'm pretty sure we get a bonus for inspecting our friend. I just don't wanna go get attacked by that bird again. Holy cow, this is absolutely ridiculous that this is happening right now. Analyze. We got him. I'm out. I'm out. Don't worry, bird. I'm done. I'm just gonna keep one of your one of your young just to make you remember who you dealt with. This is the Khan clan, baby. I think we're gonna go back home. Let's go back home over here. And there's some stuff we can do over here as well. Oh my goodness, what a day, dude. This, this game is absolutely outrageous. Boom, there it is. Home base. It's been discovered, baby. New landmark discovery. The jungle. Hidden Waterfall Oasis. Let's go. So the reason why we have the baby on our back is you literally like, the, the neuronal points that you earn are essentially your XP and you only get them when you have a baby with you. So even though we're doing all this crazy dangerous stuff, we wanna bring the babies with us because that's the name of this game. You wanna pass down your experience and knowledge to your kids, so. Was that a meteor? Are we running to the meteor right now? There's smoke coming from it. All right, man. I mean, I, I guess we could go check that out. I'm a little bit concerned about it, but sh sure, okay. Let me check my my intelligence here. Let's let's keep focusing on things and just kind of identifying new things along the way. So I'm gonna go ahead and remember that, and then we're gonna we're gonna make our way down there, and we're gonna try to try to discover stuff as we go. We obviously don't really want to be up here next to the big bad birds' nests. We're starting to learn how to how to climb, baby. That's what I'm talking about. It's like, what is this? What is this over here? Go 
Go this way. I'm pretty sure we can drop from here. Is this what we're trying to see? What is this? Going to try to discover it since we're close? It's a new landmark. The Sister Arches. Okay. So I'm going to be honest, this game just doesn't really give you a whole lot to go on. Like, it's a lot of wandering around. Kind of trying to figure out things as you go. So I'm, I'm not sure what the point of discovering these landmarks are. I'm, I'm sure it's adding XP and stuff like that to our character. But um, really, we're just going to kind of... Nice. Discover the Sister Arches is a memorable location. Really, we're just going to kind of use our, our intelligence and try to find as much as we possibly can around here. I guess now, like you guys can see, we know if we want to get back home, we just go focus on that and we can go straight home. So that's kind of cool. Oh, look at this. We can grab sticks. I haven't picked up a stick yet. All right, this is kind of impressive. I mean, what, what can we do with a stick? I feel like you can do a lot of things. Found a new tool, dead branch. Ramus Mortis. I'm gonna go ahead and grab this second one as well. All right, well, since we're still close to home, I say we just, I say we bring these back to the squad. I feel like this is a discovery that is worth, <laughs> worth sharing with the tribe. We found a stick. You guys should be impressed. Don't worry, people. I'm out here working hard or hardly working, one of the two. I found a stick. I thought I brought them both back, but I guess I dropped one of them already. Can we, hold on, I just saw this here. Can we grab sticks from these? Ah, you can just straight up, you can grab sticks from anything. Ah, nice. So we can bring these back over here. We can drop them. And then, ooh, we can, what's alter? What are we gonna do to alter it with? I don't think we can do anything. All right, just gonna go ahead and drop it. Nice. Cool. Well, it's uh, it's a little late. I'm gonna say let's let's take a little nap here. I'm gonna call old girl over, and then we're going to uh, to do the deed, make my little mating call, and then we're gonna wake up early in the morning. We're gonna go try to check out that meteor. That's a good wife right there. That's what I'm talking about. She comes running. So it's about 4 a.m. Looks like our food, water, and sleep all look pretty solid. We don't really need a whole lot of anything, but we can. Just grab some water if we're already here. I also, I think I may check out what we have going on for uh, our evolution. We haven't really evolved anything in a while. Let me lie down real quick and then let me see if we have anything. I feel like we've discovered some new stuff, so we might have some new skills. Yeah, here we go. All right, so we can um, assign neuronal energy to initiate the senses evolution. Get some better senses. Perception, the range for detection of odors and sounds is slightly increased. Tap X to use your senses, then follow the steps provided. All right. And that's going to unlock our next step for a lot of things. Um, capacity for environmental analysis will evolve. Memory. The range for detection of non-edible resources is increased. So basically our range of finding things. We just upgraded a couple of times. And I think that's all we can do for now. All right. I say, let's grab the little kiddo here. And let's go try to check out this, uh, whatever this meteor was. Jesus, Trevor, are you serious? I'm gonna get up top here so we aren't vulnerable, but one thing that's good, since we've already discovered the plant and we already, we actually just upgraded our senses to be able to see it from farther away, we should be able, here, get on this so we stop wasting our energy. We should be able to see it from farther away. So let me go into our senses here. I'm gonna go into smelling, and then we can focus and identify these options. That's what we need right there. Okay, so we're gonna be able to drop down here. Let's grab this, eat it up, and we're gonna be able to fix our broken bones. And improve our cold resistance, so that's gonna be good because it's raining right now. There we go, that's what I'm talking about. All right, let's let's uh, let's keep on the way and let's try not to fall this time, Trev. We could also be using this if we do, uh, if we do the hearing and try to see if we can notice anything on our radar and then if there are predators out there, we should, in theory, be able to hear and or see them, but that's obviously, obviously no guarantee there, so you just gotta be careful. But we're gonna keep going. 
And we're gonna find out what this meteor is all about. Bro, look at the size of that snake! Are you serious? No! Thank you! Let me take a look at that bad boy! Can I smell him? I can smell him. I'm gonna focus on him. Identify him. I don't really want to go anywhere near him, dude. Oh my... Yeah, I'll, I'll pass on that, fam. Holy cow. I don't even know where we're gonna go from here, dude. We could probably jump to this tree. That's the meteor. I guess we're just gonna have to go for it, dude. Oh, that is so freaking creepy! I'm gonna stay far away from him. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Ooh, what is this? Fear of the unknown. Use your senses and intelligence to identify what's around you. Then you'll see the light. Dopamine is needed to avoid hysteria when in fear. But what the heck? This is honestly really creepy. All right, so if we inspect things, that's gonna help us see the light. Is that what you're saying? Why do I feel like something's creeping up? Creeping up on us here? There's something right down there. I'm gonna go get that. Jump to here. And I'm gonna jump to here. Oh! What? A giant warthog just broke our bones. We missed our jump. That's what I was trying to get to. What is this? I'm gonna intimidate it. Oh, I'm a big bad monkey. That's a gator down there too. That's a big old croc. <laughs> I feel like we're I feel like we're freaking out right now. I feel like we're freaking out, and I feel like we need to get out of here. There's crocs looking at us. Our our dude is is losing his mind a little bit. Get me out of here. Run like the wind. We're okay. Dude, this is, this is like kind of, I'm trying to figure this out as we go. Basically, when we're scared in this zone, we have to go examine things that we know and that we can understand, and that's gonna comfort us, which makes total sense. I mean, that's, that's how it would work in real life. You know what I mean? So like, let me see, let me see if I can grab this. And if I inspect this, see it's showing it's got all the weird little things on it. If I inspect this, is this gonna make me feel better? Surroundings have been rationalized. We need to reach the conquer zone, which is gonna be down there. Okay. For whatever reason, sticks make me feel better. It reminds me that this is just like a normal place. This isn't, this isn't something deathly scary to be afraid of. And now, hopefully we're gonna be able to get to this, this zone and complete it. Dude, I've got sweaty palms right now. Oh my goodness. No thank you. I would, uh, I would be fine with not, not coming back here again, that's for sure. We're gonna try to drop this way, and we are gonna try to make our way back home in a quick, fast hurry, dude. We are not, we are not feeling very well. You guys can see our, our little, like, stamina circle is, is kind of in rough shape, so we're gonna look back towards home. I think this is gonna be home, right? Identify the current clan settlement. I'm gonna go ahead and memorize that. And now that's gonna show up and it's gonna be kind of like our uh, our objective marker to get back home. Holy cow, dude. If this is the, the like second area off of our home base, can you imagine how insane this game is gonna be? Oh my goodness, that was terrifying. Oh, I, my hands are, are still recovering from that. So we're gonna head back home. We're gonna take that, ooh, what is this? Have we seen these? Looks like we can inspect this. Is this a fruit or is this an egg? It looks like a fruit, but I'm hearing a bird noise. African giant mombin. Should we try it? I'm gonna try it and see what happens. That's actually gonna help out our. Uh, it's gonna help out our, our food situation. Oh, I don't. I don't think it's good though. I don't think it's good though. I think if you eat too many of those, we're gonna run into that same situation where we had like the berry poisoning or whatever. Dude, we are so close. We are right there. Don't miss this jump. 
Oh my gosh. Let's go, baby. Whew. We made it back home. Holy cow. <laughs> and you guys can see we're actually really worrying or wearing down our stamina right here. We're probably going to want to eat a few of these berries, not too many, just to get a little stamina back. So you can wear down the green all the way, and then it starts chipping away at the yellow, and that's okay. When the yellow goes all the way away, that's when you start chipping away at your, your like lifespan. So you, you don't want to chip away at your lifespan. So basically, you can take it down to yellow. You can have the yellow get really small. But anything beyond that is going to be really bad. So, dude, all I can say is we survived the day. We faced some boars, some crocs, some giant snakes. We discovered a new area. We saw a meteor. Like, what What on earth just happened? I, I That was absolutely ridiculous. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Let me know if you guys want to see more of this game. Drop a like and... Uh, I'm going to see you guys later. Peace out.